Hello and welcome back to the Second Chance to Live channel here on YouTube. I'm happy to see that you decided to stop by to watch this video presentation. In today's video presentation, I'm going to be sharing an article that I wrote several days ago. I present my articles through reading them here on the YouTube video format because I believe that individuals learn in different ways. Some individuals learn better through reading, while other individuals learn better through watching and listening. So as you listen to this article being read and as you watch this video presentation and questions come to mind, please feel free to ask me those questions. I would love to hear from you. If you'd like to leave a comment, please also do so. To read the article, I'll put my glasses back on and bring up the article. Thank you again for your time and for being here. You're a very important part of my life and I would love to hear from you. Thank you for your time. And Here's the article. Acceptance, a portal to unseen possibilities. Hello and welcome back to Second Chance to Live. I'm happy to see that you decided to stop by to visit with me. Thank you. Several days ago I wrote an article, Finding Serenity in the Midst of Frustration and Fear, in which I spoke about coming to a place of acceptance. In May of 2007 I wrote an article to share some thoughts on acceptance. I'd like to share the article with you below. In my experience, I have found that acceptance provides a portal to unseen possibilities. Here's the article, Acceptance, which I wrote in May of 2007. Hello and welcome back to Second Chance to Live. I'm happy to see that you decided to stop by to visit with me. On my journey as I've walked down the various corridors that life has revealed, I've found that life is best understood backwards. With this in mind, acceptance can appear to be a lofty goal. In the approach to living life on life's terms, many circumstances may seem to be less than palatable. Nevertheless, when I encounter the, and experience these circumstances that may grate upon my soul, I am given a choice. How I address and respond to each circumstance will impact the quality of my life. When I view life circumstances as an opportunity to learn and grow, I will see them for my good. Conversely, if I view my circumstances in a, in a critical manner, I will see them as an obstacle course set up to frustrate my life. Consequently, I may then feel victimized by those circumstances. In response, I may not consider the possibilities or solutions that may be uh, present or evident or become available or, or become revealed to me. Subsequently, if, not, if I'm not looking for solutions, my attitude can easily default to a negative thinking and pessimism. Today's thought. Each day I'm given choices. I may not think or believe that I have choices at times, but I do. Acceptance does not mean that I give up. Acceptance means that I surrender to what is and learn to grow where I am planted. My circumstances no longer need to dictate to the quality of my life. Just for today, I will determine to look for solutions. I will not allow my circumstances to dictate to me. Instead, I will cho choose to learn from what is. So through learning, I will be encouraged and empowered. I will therefore be motivated to live life on life's terms because I realize I'm a winner because of my circumstances. I want to say thank you for your time again and thank you for making Second Chance to live a regular place to visit. I look forward to hearing from you. I'll say so long for now. Have a wonderful evening and please remember do not give up on yourself, a loving God, or your process because more will be revealed. We do the footwork and trust God, a loving God, with the outcomes. So long for now, and God bless both you and your family. Thank you.